Hey you guys, Robert here, back in the kitchen doing a little cook for you tonight. If you guys watched the last video, there was some cutting up of squash. So now I'm going to show you how to make a real quick and easy stir fry of this, just to go along with your delicious steak. Okay you guys, we're over here at the stove. I'm going to add a little bit of oil to the pan to get it a little hot. And we're going to scent the oil a little bit with just a tiny bit of garlic, maybe a teaspoon, about a clove, clove and a half of garlic. around in there nice and hot and then to that we're going to put our squash right on in there give it a quick toss we don't want to burn the garlic we just want to get it start the juices flowing a little bit this is a very hot pan and I'm going to add a little bit of salt not too much and just a sprinkle of pepper now, I like my squash a little on the done side. I don't like it to be too crispy, but that's just my personal preference. You can make it how you want it. Now, if you want more than salt and pepper, you can also do that. Just giving it a quick cook. You don't have to get fancy. You can stir it around with a wooden spoon. I don't care. And I like it to get just a tiny bit of color. If you see here, Here's one. It's got just a tiny bit of color. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, it smells so good, you guys. We're going to have steak to go along with this. Some ribeye steak. Thanks, Lori. All right. And that's it. It's done. So get it off the heat. Don't overcook it. Don't kill it to death. But if you like it a little more, that's fine, too. Oh, somebody loving us. All right. Let's uh, give this a taste, you guys. It is the moment you've been waiting for. All right, you guys, we're having this for dinner, so I'm just going to have a little taste here. So this is the squash made. It's very, very easy. Mmm. So good. The taste of summer. Perfect amount of salt, a little bit of pepper, um, and the garlic. And now, if you wanted, you could, add, you could get all decadent, and you could put butter and stuff in this, but I really don't think it needs it. It's really delicious just by itself. Mmm. Fresh squash. Hope you guys try it. All right, you guys, what'd you think? Squash is pretty darn easy to prepare. Just throw it in the pan, give it a little whirl, you're good to go. If you enjoy videos like this and you like to do more stuff in the kitchen with me, hit the subscribe button right there down below. And if you like this video in particular, I'd love to have a thumbs up from you guys. Hope to get to a million subscribers by the end of the year. Take care, you guys. Bye. A little wedge here. Ooh, it's got a nice crispy bottom. Thank you.